making sure Chief's warmed up. I just cinch the girth for the second time. I do it in a two to three times, never really hard and fast the first time when we're going to go for a ride. Whoopsie, tripping and falling, that's all right. Step two and three, change direction. Come on, get going. Get going, dad a boy. Dad a boy, get out of my space. Get out of my space. Good job. Good boy. Good boy. And one and two and three. Get going that way. Get going that way. Good job. Good job. And a one rain stop with an up and over. Give me that nose. Very good. Very, very good. You're such a little snuggler, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Yes, you are. Okay. Let's make sure everything's going good today. This is going to be our first ride. I've sat on him, flexed him, but today will be the day when I actually move his feet under saddle. Very good. Making sure everything's good. Good boy. Good boy. Up and over. Up and over. Very nice. Very good. Very good. That's a good boy. All right. Go get the reins. Go. Stand. Stand. Good boy, stand. Good boy. Good boy. Very, very good. What a good boy. All right. So Chief has his all in one today with his brow band on so that the headpiece will not slide down the neck. And I'm just going to snap these reins on to the side pull loops of the all in one. Good job. So we are completely bitless. I call this iron free riding. No bits, no spurs. And in this case, no shoes either. Most of the horses when I trail ride, all of my horses wear boots. So we just use boots when we ride. Okay, so what I'm going to do with the, come around this way, do with the lead rope is I fold it in half. I don't know what your problem is, but we're going to stand over here. Okay. Now I'm going to, Fold the lead rope in half. I'm going to slide it under the gullet. And then I'll loop it over the saddle horn. I'll just grab it there. There we go. So I bring it up to about the level of the reins so that he can have full head movement both directions. Loop it over the saddle horn. Throw the end through the loop. Tighten it down. Now I've got the, the lead rope on the other side for extra pressure when I need it. Now I've never mounted him from the ground. I've always used the mounting block. So he just moved his feet. It's possible that he's going to do that when I mount and we're going to nip that in the bud. This has been an issue for him. Whenever I go to mount him, he moves. I don't want that. This is my most vulnerable position as a rider, uh, mounting and dismounting. So if he moves his feet while I try to mount, He's going to get in trouble for that, and you're going to see how I will correct him. I want to make the wrong thing uncomfortable, the right thing easy. So I'm just going to encourage him. Love him up. Good boy. Good. He's nice and flexed. I'm going to put my foot up. Shh. 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 Make that real uncomfortable. I went to put my foot in that stirrup, and he moved his, his rear feet. That's not cool. Oh. All right. Good boy. Good boy. So i got to help him understand. Put my foot up, see if it's that. No, it's not. Ah, shh. I make it real uncomfortable. I'll back him up. The reason why I back him up is because he who moves the other's feet first is in control. As a herd leader, I'm moving his feet. He's got to know you don't move your feet when I'm trying to mount. So I make it uncomfortable by controlling his feet, making it my idea that he's moving. Okay. First, I'm going to see if I've got the disengagement. So I'm going to ask for him to disengage. Good. Good. I've got that real good. 
Good boy. That's what I want. Now we'll go on the other side. Just check that disengagement. So he understands it's my idea. Put the pressure on. Ask. Good boy. Very beautiful disengagement. This guy's got really nice flex. So we're going to try this mounting again. Oh, good boy. I have to encourage him doing the right thing. And right now, standing is exactly what I want. Let him know that's the right thing. Love him up for that. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So I'm just going to put my foot up and see if he moves. Good boy. He didn't. Now he is, but that's all right. I'm not asking anything. Good job. But when I go to put my foot up there, if he moves, I'm going to make it uncomfortable. Tip his nose a little bit. Good boy. You need to stand. Stand, okay? I want you to stand. Good boy. Good boy. That's right. That's right. Very good. Very good. Grab a little rein in me. Very good. I'm going to stand. Good boy. Good boy. And I'm going to gently swing over and sit. Very good. That's right. That's right. I'm going to love you for that. I'm going to love you for that. I'm going to reach down, get my other stirrup, just gently. Very good. Very good. Now I'm going to flex him to the other side. Can I have your nose over here? Can I have your nose over here? Good. Nose over here. And I have your nose right here. Good. And he's shifting his way. He's going, oh, this feels weird. It's all right. We've only sat a couple of times. Good boy. Good boy. And flex him this way. Now I'm going to ask him to disengage. So I'm just gently put my foot on him. Ask. Good. Easy, easy, easy. Oh, you're all right. Good boy. Good job. And I'm holding that nose. Good boy. You got a little worried about that, but you know, so I just held on to the horn, tilted his nose, made sure I held on to his nose. And I'm going to ask him this side. Good job. And relax. Good boy. Now I'm going to put my foot. Good. He's starting to move. Good boy. And I release. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, it's worrisome. And he's going, oh, this is really weird. This is so strange. Because he feels out of balance with me up here. That's very odd, you know. It feels very strange. He has to adjust his body and get used to that. Can I get your nose over here? Good. I'm going to ask again on this side. And I'm going to put my foot. Ask. Very nice. That was much easier. It wasn't so scary for him this time. Pivot. Nice pivot on the inside foot there. But I've got my foot off. He just keeps disengaging. That's all right. Nice and soft with the head. He's got a nice flex. And I'm going to ask again on this side. Flex again. Good boy. It's not as, as easy on this side. A little more resistance. But I'm going to ask with my foot. Very good. So I've got my brake. My emergency handbrake working pretty good. That disengagement's pretty good. So I'm going to release. All right. Now. I'm going to apply both legs. I'm going to head to H. So I've got him tipped a little bit that way. I'm going to just ask a little forward and see if he can get his front feet unstuck. A little bit forward. Good, 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 good. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. You did pretty good. You did pretty good. Keep going. You need to go forward. Let's go over to K. Let's walk over to K. Forward we go. Forward we go. Good boy. Good boy. Good. Look at that. He's being so careful. Oh, I'm so careful. Look at that. Good boy. Good boy. And I'm going to pull him in a one rain stop. Good. Very good. Very good. Very, very good boy. That was good. Let's try a little bit more forward, okay? That was good. So I'm going to ask. Go forward. Forward. Good boy. Forward. Forward. Let's go this way. Seems like he can go to the right. Forward. A little bit easier. Excellent. Good boy. Oh, he's walking so carefully. He's going, ooh, this is weird. Somebody on me. I don't understand this. Excellent. 
Excellent. He's being so careful. Very good. Let's go this way. Can you go that way? Yeah, going to the left and forward is a little hard for him. He's like, I'm not sure about that. There you go. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. And of course, he's, he's a lot younger, so he's just going to kind of go where he thinks he wants to go. Good boy. Good boy. Very good. Very good. Keep going. Keep going. Good job. Good job. Good boy, Chief. Good boy. Very nice. He's walking so carefully. Oh, this is strange. Very good. Very good. And ho. Oh. No. I'm going to put him in a one rain stop because he didn't listen to that. He disengaged those hindquarters. That's all right. Good job. Good boy. Good boy. I'm going to pick up that front end a little bit. See if we can get him to go straight. Go straight. Nope. Go that way. Good boy. Good boy. No. Come on. It's a little young. Good job. Good job. Good boy. Good boy. Very nice. He's just walking so carefully. Now I'm going to try to hoe. And hoe. Two, three. That didn't work, so I'm going to shut him down. Good boy. Now he, of course he didn't understand that. Funny how Classy knew that. I mean, she just knew that. Her body, she's real in tune with it. And this guy, he's just young. Can I have that nose, please? I'm going to wait till he's soft. Gives. Oh, very nice. Very good boy. Very good boy. So let's try that again. Okay, let's try his head decay. Good, he's got the forward motion. He's got, he has that figured out. Very good, very good. So when we get to K, I'm going to sit on my pockets, dig down, sitting on his brake button. And ho, oh, two, three, he didn't get it, shut him down. Hold that nose, easy, easy, he's got to find his place. There, good boy, good, good boy. That was a good try. That was a good try. Let's step over this way. Good job. And go forward. You go forward for me. Let's go over that way. Good. He doesn't know of any steering. We're just kind of working with that, but he's starting to figure it out. Good boy. Good boy. And ho. Oh, two. Three. Oh, that was good. Very, very good. Now I'm going to dismount. So I'm going to wiggle a little bit. Tip that nose. Wiggle a little bit. Good boy. Now I'm going to get off. Good job. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Very good. You did an awesome job. Let me give you a big hug for that. Oh, good boy. You're a big boy now. You're a big boy now. Very good. You did such a good job. I'm so proud of you.